Hello and welcome back. My name is Alex FPS and this is the Air Force Gaming Minecraft server. And today we're going to build a really cool house. And in that house, I'm going to sell some stuff. Um, and before I do that, I kind of got to show you around the, the island here, or not the island, the spawn. Below me is a really cool base that one of the members here is working on. Work in progress, but it's huge as you can see and it's awesome. They got some organizational stuff, working on village, I think. Uh, I got some bees going on down there. See if I can zoom in. Uh, maybe not. Okay. Just, you see them down there in the corner. Uh, anyway, so I want to show you the rest of this area before I go off and show you the time lapse of my build. Okay, so when you first join the server, you end up in the woods over here, and then you can make your way to this beacon, and without showing you the house I've been working on, I'm going to walk over to this path over here, and we're going to run along this path. You get over here, got you know a lit path here, got some lanterns, and you'll come around over to here where the path kind of ends, you get this dirt path starting. And then this is the village where pretty much all the members kind of set up shop. Uh, we got some people here, like home of Deadpool Crickson, no touchy. And then back there, we got a super awesome build. I think it's Talentless built that one. Uh, work in progress. And then kind of a few people just picked a house and they're just kind of living in that house, which is cool. We got another portal and we're doing our things on another roof, as you might have seen in a previous video. Uh, but I wanted to do a little bit of organization, kind of have a purpose build over here in the spawn area because I'm I'm just over here over the mountains I wanted to get away from the spawn chunks so you can see my base just over the mountain here so what I want to do was I want to build a house where I could maybe sell things or maybe give things away or trade things so I built I'm gonna call it the trader's cabin or the iron call it like an iron store I'll, I'll come up with the name for it you could just see it off the corner of the screen there there's another work in progress build uh, but what I'm gonna do is show you that build I'm gonna hop to the time lapse so you can see it you can check it out, this cool build here. And what I'll do is show you that time lapse and then come back in and show you the inside because the inside of it's really cool. You'll see what I did for the like the iron trade store type thing. So pretty awesome. And uh, yeah, let's get, let's get into it. How did you like the time lapse? You get to see the whole house kind of start to finish. Some of the changes I made, like with the roof, the dark oak, changing it from spruce and everything, and moving these logs out. I really liked how it looks. I liked how uh, it turned out a lot better than it originally started. I just kind of started throwing stuff down. Anyway, let's go on the inside and kind of check it out. All right, now that we're on the inside, we can just start by coming through the door, and there's this cool section here we'll show that in a second but first i want to show this area we got these sweet little villagers hanging out over here we got some uh, toolsmith masters over here uh pretty cool trades i mean you get a, a good shovel and a decent pickaxe 
kind of expensive, but we haven't done any kind of zombification stuff. So uh, we got this guy over here. We got some heads on the, the ceiling display because this guy is he's super awesome. He's a... Uh, he murders things like wandering traders because you know those guys take away from the the business. So wandering traders aren't um they're not welcome here. Uh, we got some iron bars hanging up here. Once 1.16 comes out, this guy will be hanging from a chain, which would be awesome. Uh, we got some anvils over here because you know it's a it's an iron shop, whatever. We got some iron armor over here, and uh, this guy, this guy is selling armor. I gotta level him up a few more times, but you know they're always asking for for diamonds. These guys want diamonds. Like what's going on there? Like anyway. So let's move on to the next section. We got some iron. It's like a display of iron. You know, you smelt it down or whatever. Get it in here. And then over here, this is the cool stuff. I'm calling it the Iron Exchange. Welcome to the Iron Exchange. One stack of iron costs two stacks of wood. So if you want to go out and get two stacks of dark oak, which is my favorite, then by all means, come in here and swap out one of these stacks of iron for two stacks of whatever wood you want, besides birch, because I don't care about birch. I hate birch. I don't really hate birch, but it's only good for... A few things and i don't do a lot of that so anyway you can also play with two diamonds if you you know have a lot of diamonds or whatever but really the two wood is super easy and anybody you know coming off the start of the server will be able to the night time we better sleep we got to do one more thing in here before we can call it finished uh let's see you guys can probably already tell what i'm gonna do here Wrong thing. There we go. We have an iron golem protecting these guys in here. Hopefully it doesn't cause any trouble. Uh, I don't want anything to go wrong in here, but he'll hang out with my guys and hopefully keep them safe. Uh, nothing should be able to get through the doors unless somehow the doors break. So we're good here. I guess I can show the outside, kind of what it did. I got some dark oak trim at the top, some fence post and a lantern. Uh, and then over here, we got like a little garden section. Got these gates. I love how this little arch happens when you put the gates in between fences. Or, uh, yeah, fences. And uh, so you come around here. We got some leaves hanging, like vines. Got some mossy stone mixed with some cracked stone. And then you come around here, and it's pretty uh, pretty much the same all the way around. I put poppy seeds here in these planters because, you know, it's an iron store. And iron golems have poppy seeds, or poppy flowers, I should say. And that that's it. So all on all sides, we got that. It's pretty cool. I really like how it turned out. I made a few tweaks, as you saw in the, the time lapse. But... That's going to be it for this uh, this build here. I really like how it turned out. I hope you do too. Let me know in the comment section below if you like it. And then also drop a like, do all that good stuff. Make sure you subscribe if you haven't already. And I appreciate you watching and I will see you next time.